Hello adventure lovers and welcome to A Walk Through the Conversion. This is your host Vidushi. If you're new here, Walk Through the Conversion is where you and I get to have a detailed detour of the conversions. So, 2022, three more months till the touchdown and before that, the joys of Diwali, the Shera, even Halloween, Christmas and New Year's, which means a lot of holidays in hand and a chance to get away in the laps of nature. And if you are looking for a safe and isolated way to travel, then this may be your suitor. Presenting to you the star of today's episode, Willow. on a Ford's 4020 wheelbase powered by Mercedes OM617 series engine. This expandable home on wheels looks graceful when compact but is also majestic and spacious enough to sleep 6 to 8 plus driver and helper, all complementing its name Willow. So without the further ado, let's walk through this conversion. The exterior is painted in a gunmetal grey. The front fascia has been custom curated according to Willow's dimension. There is also a winch with a 10 ton capacity as well as 30 inches tyres and rims that have been custom fitted. There is a total of 4 security cameras, a parking camera, GPS, 3 batteries, 1 main and 2 auxiliary and a solar panel on the rooftop. There's an awning on the co-driver's side as well as an outsource supply to put up your barbecue. Now let's move to the rear exterior. We have a pivoting or a swing arm carrier that further holds a 40 litre fuel tank as well as a spare tyre. So the pivoting carrier here was created to provide access to the storage area from the outside. Now this, in my opinion, is one of the coolest details of Willow. Looks like nothing, right? But this is how it looks during the night time. These are custom curated CNC tail lights. Speaking of lights, the lights that you see on the top are not there just to beautify the camper, but this is an American standard for caravans and special purpose vehicles. I think these little details like the front fascia, the CNC lights is what makes Willow different than an ordinary tempo traveler. On the rear driver side, we have an external shower setup that comes with both cold and hot water supply. Now this can be used both by the staff members or even by you after a post beach or post workout run. I think we have covered everything on the exterior. Now let's walk through the interior, shall we? Behind the sliding entryway door is a clean lounging space. Now this is something that you cannot see but Willow is soundproof and insulated. There are two lagoon tables to transition this area from a diner into a lounging area. This is a flip-flop sofa come bed and this one right here is a single side expandable sofa. Both of these combine to form a queen size bed and have ample storage space inside. Now we know that campaigning season is right around the corner. So we've also left a provision of storing a lift and an access through the top hatch so as to convert Willow into an election rut whenever required. Now we're not done with this seating space. There's also a motorized drop down bed that can be converted through a push of a button. Both of these beds can form a sleeping space for at least five to six if you are not a mover that is and what else do we have there is a 32 inches smart tv battery operated lights charging socket a smart music system apart from a 12 kva auto ac there's also a one ton cassette ac that can be powered through the external outsource either a power hookup or an external genset i think 3 kva is pretty much sufficient now let's move to the heart of this home the kitchen area 
The kitchen in Willow comes with a two-top burner, a sink that has both cold and hot water supply. There's a 20-liter convention, an 80-liter dual compressor base fridge that we have customized in-house. There's also an acrylic top bar and storage space to store not only your cutlery, utensils, groceries, but also a blast-proof cylinder. Now moving to a motorhome adventure staple, the bathroom. Now we already have a detailed detour of the bathroom mentioned on our channel, which you can find through the link right here or here. But to brief it out to you guys, the bathroom in Willow is somewhat special because we have leveled up or upgraded our usual technology. There is a touch control base operation and a separation between the shower and commode compartment. As I said, you can find the detailed detour of the bathroom of Willow linked up somewhere. And now to the grand finale of this home on wheels. This room also comes with a 32 inches smart TV, a smart music system, battery operated lights and another one ton cassette AC on the top. Now this sofa seats up to three on board and it can also convert into a bedding area sleeping two adults. This can be converted into a bed that is 5.5 feet wide and 6.3 feet long. Now I know what you're saying, how can this area be converted into a bedding? A little help here please. Press the button and the expandable deck expands up to 4 feet. The expansion is actually a smart way of creating space while keeping the conversion guidelines in mind as well as keeping the body as is. There's also a skylight for your stargazing session in the middle of Ladakh, Spiti or Mustang. Now to the final few amenities of this camper. This room also has a lagoon table. The rear hatch can be used as an emergency exit. There are blinds all throughout the camper and the sides are made up of reinforced fiber panels that come with pockets to store your knickknacks. And that concludes this episode of a walk through the conversion. By now you guys already know that Willow is a comfortable home for at least 6 to 8 people. And on that note, we are calling all the travel lovers. If you are interested in an isolated getaway, Willow is now officially live on our website and available for your next trip. As for interested buyers, as always information related to buying, building or purchasing will be mentioned in the description box below. Oh, and if you're interested in getting the updates of our newest creations and videos before they are even available to anyone, you can click on the link right here which says keep me posted and we will be sending you the link before it is available to the rest of the audience. Now before you go, I just want you guys' help in one more thing. So we have done multiple polls and Q&As on our Instagram, Facebook and other social media platforms asking you guys what language you prefer the walkthroughs in and we have always got mixed responses. And doing the walkthroughs in every language is not a possibility but we are open to recording or actually dubbing the exact same episode in Hindi. So we just want to know about your feedback. If you are with it, then just comment Hindi is fine. If not, then say English for the go. We hope you like this walkthrough and this conversion. And if you did, then please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel for we will be posting many more fun conversion and travel videos in the home away home on wheels. Thank you so much for coming by. I'll be back in a jiffy. Motorhome Adventures signing off.